Hey guys, this is Garage Sale Addict back again with another video. Uh, in this video, I'm going to be doing some PlayStation 2 finds that I found recently. And uh, first, we have a PlayStation 2 Patriots controller. Uh, got this for a buck. Uh, it's really good condition. It's Mad Cats. Um, Patriots are one of the top. Uh, liked teams. I wouldn't say they're liked, but uh, they're more popular. So a lot of people are gonna, you know, want this. Uh, I think I could get five or ten for it. So not a bad buy there. Um, all these PlayStation 2 games I got for a dollar. So we got Jaws Unleashed, uh, Greatest Hits version. We got Backyard Football 2008. It's not the best to buy uh, sports games, but Backyard Sports are a different kind. Uh, sometimes you can get good money for it. Soul Calibur 2. Uh, that's a pretty good buy. A lot of people are into the Soul Calibur uh, series, so people would pay some money for it. And I usually sell for the, these for two or three dollars. Uh, the PlayStation 2 games. Um, I sell individual ones that are worth uh, five or ten. I go ahead and sell those online. But the ones I can't sell, like the sports games, or so I'll take to a flea market. And there's always people there who are willing to pay two or three dollars for a PlayStation 2 game all day. So next we got Thrillville Off the Rails. Uh, this is a pretty cool game. I've played it. Uh, you build racetracks, or not racetracks, but roller coasters, and you have your own theme park, and you have to manage that theme park like a business and try to make money. We got Cabela's Dangerous Hunts 2009. Uh, this is the newest Cabela's on PlayStation 2, so this is a uh, the best one that you can get for PlayStation 2. Uh, plus it's a black label. Always good. Well, yeah, NBA Ballers. This is a uh, not really a sell. Probably won't sell it. This is one of my favorite games I used to play. So I'll probably keep that. But still it's just a buck. And it's a sports game as well so normally I wouldn't buy it. But it's uh, one of my favorites, so I went ahead and dropped out the buck. We got Over the Hedge. Um, games from movies, it really depends on what the movie is for the worth, uh, for the value of the game. Over the Hedge was kind of a popular movie for the kids. It's by DreamWorks. Um, I have not played this. But looks like there's many games, um, and there's 30 levels of play. So I would think that would be worth something. I have not checked yet, but you'd think that'd be worth something with the level of gameplay. We got Civil War: A Nation Divided. I actually have a few copies of this. It's um, a game a lot of people have, and I don't think it really did very well. I actually haven't even played it because there's so many others shooting games and uh, other games that you can play other than this. And I I see it so often that I just don't think that it would be a very good game. But you know, anyone would pay a couple bucks for it, especially with the historic. Uh, aspect. And I actually got a DVD X-Men 1.5. I got this for 50 cents. Um, it has a few discs in here. We have the whole team X-Men on here. It has, still has a, the manuals. has both discs. Uh, looks like nothing's broken here. So that's good. This is not a sell either. 
this is uh, something I'll watch. So, pretty good buy for 50 cents. Um, can't really go wrong for DVD with for 50 cents, especially if you want to buy it for yourself. So those are my PlayStation 2 finds and actually a DVD find uh, that we had. So check out my next video and I'll be showing you guys my finds for next week. Thanks for watching.